Social Security Administration came to us several years ago uh, seeking help to improve their disability evaluation program. And we suggested uh, a paradigm shift. We suggested that they reconceptualize disability and that they operationalize it in line with more um, contemporary models such that they envision it as um, individual capabilities in the context of, in this case, workplace demands. Because uh, a lot of what we do is uh, using large pre-existing data sets or creating new methodologies, our research group is a little different than your typical NIH intramural program. We focus on health services research, that is, uh, research that we hope directly affects uh, health policy. The fact that we're a government agency and we're able to collaborate with another government agency really facilitates the work. We're, we are living under the same policies and types of procedures, which makes it much easier to work together. We have shared goals. Um, and so I actually think that this project couldn't be done anywhere else. I think it's uniquely done here. What uh, is special about our group is the intellectual capacity. Uh, and the breadth of experience of the individual. So we have been able to bring together mathematicians, economists, social workers, health services researchers. Uh, Beth, by training, is a physical therapist, but also has a PhD in epidemiology. My training is in rehab medicine, but also I have a master's of public health. Having friends with disabilities and working with people with disabilities on a daily basis, I realized that the issues that were interfering with their ability to do what they want to do in everyday life had very little to do with their physical abilities or their cognitive abilities. It had to do with societal, society's perception of what they could and couldn't do and, and their acceptance of people with disabilities and programs, policies that support them or don't support them.